Programming Languages and Design Concepts Online Presentation Series about Language Principles So here is our group information Group ID 87 Leader GIU Giganage Members AC Nanayakkara JCR Vimalasuriya GRSS Jayaratna KPK Sri Lal Here is brief introduction of about the online series We are expecting to do as the first part of our lecture series to discuss about basic seven principles in programming language design 0 1 infinity data abstraction syntactic consistency structured programming elegance defense in depth orthogonality so those are the basic principles and we are hoping to discuss about those things in details with some examples so this is our first principle called zero one infinity principle so the description is shown above in the slide so it's not get any simpler meaning so we can simply say about that as a programmer you are not eager to remember much more rules in additional to the coding stuff so always the codi coder likes to keep limited rules in his mind about the language concepts or the limitations in language itself not for the entire logic of the program so he is responsible for co develop the coding but he is not responsible or not well so enough practice to remember those bulk of rules inside the language so it simpler simply idea shows in the middle section even you are a developer you have to define some rules on other than coding let it make the ranges of constant limits for a large amount so in the example says the Perl language itself places no limitations on the size of arrays so you can declare any number of arrays and de declare the spaces for that arrays and scalars and also but uh, in Fortran language some early stage language it has only the character 31 character variable length for its variable declaration so in early stages the code the coders have to remember those things also but in now the most languages support for the developer to freely develop his own logic not getting much more rules and also cons constraints so it facilitated to define much more space or objects or classes inside the language as the memory is available so our next principle is data abstraction and encapsulation this is an main aspect of object oriented programming in programming efforts it is easy for a user to identify the purpose of the programming and specifications of that and characteristics and also methods relevant to that object so it he clearly says that the basic concept in OOP the major feature is data hiding so why we are using the data hiding concept because other otherwise we have to 